facility with a cadaver. Good work. Please proceed into the facility with a cadaver. Administering shock. Stand clear. Well, you certainly caught me with my pants down. Glad you could make it, Sam. Hmm. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to alarm you, but I am what I am. Ah, oh, please, lay her down there. Still no sign of them. You know, your heart stops beating. It stops every 21 minutes. I spend three minutes on the beach, and then return. 60 deaths and 60 resurrections per day. 60 opportunities to search the beach for my departed family. This is how I live. This is my life. So, while you've traveled to and from the sea an impressive number of times, my beach count is a little higher. 218,549. <laughs> hmm. I see myself in that crater. My wife and my child. It's like looking at the shape of my heart. The doctors called it myocardial cordophonia. Mine is an especially unusual case. I have pictures. Care to see heart went heart shape heart? <laughs> no, you really should. It doesn't run in the family. You know, I never came to terms with their loss. In the days that followed, I became obsessed with an idea that the beach is real and they are on it. I would induce cardiac arrest three minutes at a time, and search for them, day after day after day. Or else you could say goodbye. Quite the opposite. It is said that everyone's beach is different. So what if everyone's afterlife is different too? 